Alright, Rampage Indonesia. 306. Oh my god. We one hit to the body. We slammed the guy. Woo! This one is the legendary chaperone version of the good bone structure. Why is it the legendary chaperone? Well, it's very simple. It has outlaw and rampage. Now I know the destiny two version of the chaperone doesn't have increased reload on headshot kills, but once upon a time in a wonderful game called destiny one, when you got a headshot kill with the chaperone, you gained increased reload speed as well as all of the other benefits that you still receive in today's game. Well, like I said, in the D1 game, you would get Outlaw on a headshot kill with Chaperone. And of course, you get increased damage on a headshot kill with the Chaperone. Obviously, this is slightly different because you don't need a headshot kill to proc Rampage, but it's the same thing, right? You shoot someone with a slug shotgun and you do increased damage for a short period of time. So we stuck a Rampage spec mod on this good bone structure to give us as much uptime as possible with high damage potential. And to top it all off, we've taken it another step further we're on code of the missile and that means we have got inertia override and sliding over special ammo increases your damage for a couple of seconds now when you stack inertia override and rampage on the good bone structure you do 201 damage to the body and up to almost 400 damage to the head it becomes an absolute monster this weapon is so absolutely filthy for going on kill sprees and uh, i had to show it to you guys i had this roll and i was like yo at first, I was like, you know, whenever you get Outlaw on a shotgun, your first reaction is, now nah, it's terrible. But then I remembered this is a slug shotgun, you're going to be hitting headshots. And I saw Rampage and I was like, you know what, I have a Rampage spec mod on a trust that I never use anymore. So I sharded my old trust, like slapped this mod on this good bone structure. And I've got to say, the game you're going to see here on Pantheon, a 47 defeat game. And it's a lot of fun, man. This, this shotgun has never felt better for me. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the setup, the legendary chaperone good bone structure. If you have this roll yourself lying around in the vault, take it out for a spin. If you have a rampage spec mod, even better. That's it from me guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you do enjoy the video, don't forget to hit that like button. If we could hit 2000 likes on this video, I would be forever grateful to you guys for all your insane support. I feel like 90,000 subscribers is approaching quickly. And once we get to 90,000 subscribers, 100,000 subscribers is only 10,000 away. Yo, thank you guys so much for your support. Hope you enjoy it, and I will see you tomorrow. Damage. No, I choked it. There we go. Doing 313 to the head. Nasty. Absolutely nasty. Alright, Rampage and Inertia, 306, oh my god, we one hit to the body, we slammed the guy, woo, fucking lit, I one hit to that, I one hit that guy with a body shot, crazy, oh rip, holy fuck. I need to watch that back, but I definitely killed that guy with a body shot because I had Inertia Override and Rampage times two or three stacked together. Uh, that was crazy. Oh, hello. Oh, oh somebody else took the ammo. Okay, somebody got machine gun. Three hundred and fifty-eight to the head. Holy fuck! Oh shit, that was a Wardcliffe coil. Not much you can do about that. Man, if I had Anteus wards on though, ah oh, fucking hell! If I had Anteus wards on, I don't know if One Eye's even helping me with this setup. I think Anteus wards might be better. I mean, I would have lived there, for example. Helps you slide over ammo too. Come on, teammates, they're so weak. Fuck, I'm dead. Alright, 
swear if I die twice to one super, I will cry. Actual tears. No, I'm not gonna bother. Too many of them laning that. Might actually go and cap B while they're all in A for whatever reason. Alright, about clapping the flag, yeah, forget that. Okay, we got a lot of ammo. I want to go for B, but I just feel like I'm going to get lit up. God damn it, I overcommitted so badly. <laughs> I shouldn't be alive right now. Take this. What have I even got? I've got Black Talon. Okay. Oh yeah, I love Black Talon, it's so much fun. Only thing is swords will get enough ammo in D2, man. In D1 you'd have like 25 shots on a pickup. Fuck yeah, I'm going in. Oh hell yeah. Yeet! <laughs> Oh my god, someone is chasing. Slide over this. I fucked it up. Still gonna push. Is someone capping C? Yes. Oh, cap C, my teammates. And I'm gonna death from above you. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna get team shot out. <laughs> yeah, using outbreak perfected. I was thinking about doing an, like an inertia override outbreak perfected video, but for me, guys, I don't really enjoy using pulse rifles a great deal, so I didn't bother. I do like using slug shotguns though. Sluggies are a lot of fun. God, what am I doing? Zone a you have so basically, what Rampage does for the weapon is it basically increases the effective range. So, like, that's why I'm saying it's a legendary chaperone. You get a kill, and you're doing more damage, you're reloading faster. Very much like the Roadborne perk. Obviously, the only difference is you're not getting extra aim assist or, you know, things like that. Whoa. But, can't tell me this isn't pretty nasty though, right? Ooh, okay, it wasn't that nasty, apparently. <laughs> the thing as well that I enjoy about the good bone structure is that you don't see it as much as you see the chaperone. Like, you, if you guys have been following my channel since the D1 days, you know chaperone is my signature weapon. And the reason why the weapon, it worked as my signature weapon, because in D1, nobody used chaperone apart from me. But in D2, it's a very common weapon, especially on Hunter with the Spectral Blades. It's a very common setup. So I'm just, I don't know, man. It just annoys me seeing everyone use it. Oh, I almost fucking gave that guy the turn. And also, one of the other reasons why I'm not using Chaperone, I have to admit, is there are not many energy hand cannons that I enjoy using with it. The only one I'd say is maybe Kindled Orchid. What the fuck? 
Like if I could use spare rations with chaperone, I might use it more than I currently do. I had to seal the deal there because he was in the well of radiance. Ah, I really should have. I probably should have done Antaeus swords, but it saved me a couple of times. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section about this um, setup. Outlaw rampage, good bone structure. Something different, not your typical god roll. Ooh, we body shot with fucking. Ooh, we. Hey, dude, you should maybe look this way. Ooh, we. <laughs> Come on, one more guy. I want to shoot one more person before the game ends. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, this guy right here. Oh. Ah. There's always some bot with Jotun that ruins it, man. There's always some Jotun bot that ruins it. But we crushed them. I wonder how many kills we got. Let's have a look. Ah, oh, almost a 50 kill game. If I had Antaeus was on, I think that would have been a 50 plus kill game. Oh well, Legendary Chaperone, there you go. Hope you guys enjoyed it. 